Hey guys, so today we're going to be doing my October journal flip through and my junk journal. Um, this was a composition notebook, but I altered it and so now it is a junk journal. I just added one and a half inches to the spine following Elizabeth's tutorial at Never Hopeless by Elizabeth. This I just made, um, oh my gosh, my mind went blank. Embroidery floss string and took some beads and then I just tied this ribbon right here to add some extra flair. And then this said pumpkin spice, but I don't know where the other half of the U went. But I did make this with my Cricut. Yeah, and they're peeling up, so. And at the bottom it just says October, November. So yeah, this does have both of those in here. So on this side of my journal, I have these stickers that have the November 2020 calendar. And the October 2020 calendar. I have my name, my address right here. This is a big wall sticker that I got from the Dollar Tree. I put this in here for Breast Cancer Awareness Month since that was October and I got this from a magazine. Okay, so this was my October cover page, I guess. I don't know. I never just did do anything with this, but this was just the page that I had used to sew in here. And I thought it looked cool, so I left it. This October sticker is from Sticker Guru subscription box. <clears throat> and then this paper clip right here I got off Amazon in a multi pack of embellished paper clips. Okay, so on this first day. Sorry, let me let my cat out for Sorry about that, but if I didn't do that, he was just going to get louder. <laughs> Okay, so here I have a picture of me with my one of my dogs and one of my kitties. This is my kitty River. This is my dog Ellie. Um, if you see these house stickers a lot in here, I got them from the Dollar Tree and I just use this to symbolize if like I was at home. So and then right here I wrote the words Big Brother because that is like my favorite TV show, and we were binge watching it. So here's my journaling. There's scrap of paper on the back. This is just a memo sheet pad from the Dollar Tree. I actually have it right here. I got it from the Dollar Tree. So. And then here I got a new mask. So I took the pocket and stuck it in there. These are just some notes from my church. And then I use these suns to, sim to symbolize like the weather. Or if it's raining, I just use something else. Maybe. Yeah, and that's just a big pocket. In here, I have a little tip in, which is from the Sticker Guru subscription box that I was telling you that I got this October sticker from. So, I included this because their postcards or like their business cards are so cute. Like, I love them. If you have put it like this, y'all can see it better. Oh, the paper clip just fell. I'll get that in a minute. Okay, so this day, um, I put my to-do list down here. I use this pretty cat washi I have. It's a day I went on a date with my boyfriend. I used a weekend sticker. My journaling's in this little pocket right here, which is on a Project Life card. Okay, so on this page, I got some mail from a college. So I stuck that in here. And then I have a picture of a dog that I met at a birthday party I went to. And I just have my journaling on the actual page. 
I have a tag from where I bought my kitty his Halloween costume. And yes, I know I spelled anxiety wrong, but that just shows you how bad it was that day. So on this page, me and my boyfriend took my brother fishing. Um, I put this boost your mood because I was in a really ill mood. And this is a Project Life car with the journaling on it in this pocket right here. Here are the pictures. There's my kitty in his new Halloween costume, my boyfriend helping my brother fish, and like the sunset. Okay, so on this page, some more mail from a college. I put this in here because it was my favorite snack for my to-do list. My journaling on this card. There's, see, there's the house sticker. And here is a picture of my neighbor's dog. I love pictures of animals, so. Okay, so this page, this background is from a Vera Bradley book. I think it's called Live Life in Color, but I cut it up and took this as a background. Then these are Happy Planner stickers usually that I use for like my date to stick my dates on. And this says trial and error is the way to go. If you truly want to forge your own path, you're going to have to open to to be open to making mistakes. Just keep your course and surround yourself with people who believe in what you are creating. I love that, so I stuck that in there. So on this page, I took my brother's cat to the vet. I went to Walmart, and that's basically all we did on that page. I didn't have much to say. <laughs> So on this page, I have my journaling on this cutout from a piece of scrapbook paper. This is a pocket from the Vera Bradley book. Some washi. This is my dad's debit card that I accidentally lost and he had to cancel and then I found it. So Okay, so on this page, I did a cool little thing that I really liked. So I made a smaller pocket up here, which I put this in because I got this Baby Yoda stuffed animal. I love stuffed animals. And then down here I have my journaling in a pocket. And have this Baby Yoda sticker that I got off Amazon. Okay, so this day I put this quarantine sticker because at the end of the day, I ended up not feeling so good. Um, this is a boot cutout that I got from a magazine up in there because I got new heels. See, I used this umbrella so much it was raining because we had Hurricane Delta. Okay, so on this page, I have my journal in this little pocket down here. I've got a bed picture from a magazine because I stayed in bed all day because I was so sick. And then these quarantine stickers I got from Amazon. This right here is actually my COVID results because I did get tested, but it was negative. So, okay. So this next page, this is an envelope I got in Happy Mail. I have all my journaling over here. This is from Poppy Seed Letters. Her stationery is amazing. You should check her out. She is on Facebook and Etsy. And then I had another bed day. So there's a bed image. And I got some new stamps. So there's that up there. Okay, so on this day, I forgot to tell you where I got all the backgrounds from, but I'll do that for now on. This is, this like rose gold background is from a wrapping paper thing, which most of these backgrounds are wrapping paper actually. 
So here I have a tux pot with my journaling on it. And here I had an eye doctor's appointment, so I put that on there. Um, I put this Mickey Mouse sticker because I did get this. Oh my gosh, I dropped it. Hold on. Okay. I got this Mickey Mouse plush. And I love them. It's just like my Yoda one. Okay, so next page. This was my brother's birthday. So this is wrapping paper. And I use these Toy Story Sim stickers because they're his favorite things. Um, I use this pizza sticker because we had pizza. And this is just some scrap of paper I backed on the back of my journaling, which is a Snoopy stationery, which I got sent in Happy Mail. So, on this page, I didn't do much, but this background is from a magazine. So... This day it was my brother's birthday party. So I put the invitation right here. My journaling is on this card. This background is from a magazine. And there's a picture of my kitty sleeping up here. Okay, so on this page, I use some scrapbook paper, two more backgrounds. And this was a chill day at home, but I didn't really have much to decorate. So on this day, I got new glasses. I filmed a YouTube video. I had to go get my shoulder x-ray because it popped out of place. And okay, so on this day, it was my grandmother's birthday. Um, yeah, my darling's on this card right here. Okay, so these are some notes from my church that I just tipped in. Um, I had an SGA meeting. And it was sunny, so... Her and my pages were kind of boring. <laughs> uh, here I had my journaling tipped in. I started back to in-person school. I have all my assignments I had to do before the first day. This is from a Mantra Wellness magazine down here. On this page, I had this image of grapes, and it has been my favorite snack, so I did that. My journaling is tipped in on a Project Life card. So here, I put this rain sticker because it was raining. This is a wrapping paper background. So is this. So is this. I'm so bad at this. I'm sorry. So on this day, stayed at home, took a nap. <laughs> That's really all my journal is about, but it's okay. I have fun creating the pages. So if you think your life is boring, you can still create pages. Uh, here is a tip in for my doctor's thing for my next appointment. Um, I'm gonna cover this up because this is a prescription. But I did just tip this in with some washi tape and it's a Project Life card. And so do you see that picture right there? That is what my shoulder looks like. I'm not sure if y'all can tell, but yeah. And by the way, that background was wrapping paper. So on this day, I took my brother trunk or treating at a local school. My journaling's on this memo sheet that I got sent in Happy Mail. But here is my brother. Right there. Okay, so on this page I have some more church notes I tipped in. I had physical therapy. Stayed at home other than that. This background is wrapping paper. This is from a paper pack I got at Hobby Lobby. Another Project Life card journal spot. Okay, so here, more wrapping paper backgrounds. And 
This Project Life card is so pretty. I got sent in a Happy Mail. This is a Happy Planner sticker, and this sticker right here is from my Antiquarium sticker book. Okay, on this page, I did it Halloween because it was the 30th, but we did do some Halloween activities, so my journal goes right here. And then I just decorated, like, it was some Halloween stickers. And I put this, I'm a voter in Georgia, because that was my boyfriend's voter sticker. Okay, so this is Halloween. I love this. Okay, so this is an envelope. I got some Happy Mail. <clears throat> but in here I have this. Okay, so you see a theme. I really like these. So my boyfriend has been getting me some. Um, I got a new pop socket for my phone and... Have my journaling on this piece of scrapbook paper in here so i just stuck that all in there and my boyfriend got me a bunch of gifts because it was our three-year anniversary so yeah and then down here i have a wristband because we went to a pumpkin patch while i took my brother there so here i have a bunch of pictures and it just captured today this is me and my boyfriend um, I have a picture of me and my kitty. We saw a zebra, my little brother and his friend. Uh, me and my little brother have a big age gap. Like, it's like 11 years difference. Anyways, here is a picture of a baby cow. And I now want one. So, I accidentally added too many pages in October. So, I just tipped in some postcards I got sent in Happy Mail, but yeah. Biggies are my exercises that I have to do with my shoulder, so I put that in with some washi. And that was all for my October, but here is November. This is from my old Happy Planner, and it has like the November tab. I will go ahead and show you these pages, but yeah. This was mine and my boyfriend's anniversary of three years. We went to a pumpkin patch, and we went shopping, so just put a bunch of stuff that we bought in here, and some journaling spots, and I just did a collage of pictures of us throughout the three years. In here, I had Wendy's, I had a chill day on the couch, I had a physical therapy. And that is all I'm going to show you because I don't want to get into the election political stuff on here. So, I will do that in a November flip through. So, I'm going to film like maybe a journal with me or a glue with me. And I'm going to be telling you guys about my favorite YouTubers. So, that will be the next video. But I hope you guys enjoy and bye guys.